I remember, well, the first date I guess I really remember was we went to Dunnes Peak and went for a hike, which is something like we still like doing together. It was fun, it was a good day. Like we kind of just like spent the afternoon together, I think. I think after the ship, that was the one of the first things we did. And we went to the Brown Dog and we got fritters and that was where I kissed you for the first time and I dropped them. <laughs> and it was the most awkward first kiss. But we still went out after that, and it, it only got better since then. I still look back on it fondly. Fondly, eh? Yeah. <laughs> I texted you after I got home and said, don't worry, it'll get better than that. <laughs> and you were like, oh, it's because I dropped the fritters. Yeah, the fritters were good, though. <laughs> they were worth it, worth it. <laughs> Modern day love story, meeting through a dating app where I honestly did not expect much. This worked out much better than I imagined. You always joke with me that after our first date, I begged you to go out with me again. I'm not sure if that's quite how it happened, but we have been inseparable ever since, so I'll give you that. I have seen the best of you, and I have seen the worst of you, but I choose both, always. I am so grateful for this life we're building together and the beauty of it is that we don't know what the future looks like. It doesn't really matter though, because as long as we're together, I know we'll find happiness. I love you forever, my handsome man. When I'm with you. Christina, from the moment we met, I knew you were special, but little did I know that after meeting you six years ago, that I'd be up here at the altar with you. I vow to be there to catch you if you should fall, to be your best friend, your consoler, and your husband. We'll work through all the challenges we face together as a team. It won't always be easy, and I know sometimes I'll annoy you, but I'll always have your back. I know there's tons of amazing times ahead and that our marriage will be beautiful. You're everything I ever wanted. My dream girl, my once in a lifetime soulmate. I'm so excited because I get to spend the rest of my life with you, my best friend and now wife. Oh, Christine. I'm with you. I know that you feel the same way too. Shows in every little thing you do. Nothing's better than when I'm with you. You. Oh my God, you look so beautiful. Like I've been good? waiting to see you all day. Yeah. Good? Wow. <laughs> Thank you.
Christina, ever since I've met you, especially after visiting Halifax with Jordan, I knew you were a keeper. I'm really excited to have you a part of the family, in particular because I need an accountant to do my taxes on my rental property. You've brought out Jordan's personality in the purest way and have really made him a gentleman. I know Jordan's mother-in-law is going to correct me when I say this Italian saying, Evivi Gli Sposi, long live the bride and groom. Christina, I knew you were the one from the moment Jordan told me about you. He had a sparkle in his eye and his smile gave it away. In that moment, I knew you were family. Christina, you are kind, intelligent, patient, and perfect in every way. Thank you for choosing Jordan to be your partner in crime. evident that Chris and Jordan bring out the best versions of each other. He's always been the silly to her serious, the risky to her cautious, and the spontaneous to her organized. Although you have a new partner in crime, I will always be your little sister who looks up to you. You're forever my inspiration, and I truly can't wait for more adventures and memories with now you and my new brother-in-law. <laughs> <laughs>